All right, everybody, welcome back to another video. Today, we're playing some Callista in the top lane, running Lethal Tempo, Triumph, Alacrity, Last Stand, Conditioning, and Overgrowth. I want to go tank Callista, because I can already kite people with her Callista. dashes with every auto. And if I'm super tanky, I'll just me. never die. So I want to try and get a hard steal first. And then we could do Titanic Hydra on her, too. It's not bad. Oh, it's not a Garen top. Wait, who is it? Oh man, is it a Karma top? Why? It's okay. I'll still run her over. I would have liked to play against a melee champ to kite him, but... I don't know, what's worse? We're both ranged tops, but this guy's playing Karma. Hey guys, quick shout out from our sponsor, Raid Shadow Legends. Victory awaits in the realm of Teleria to those who can pick the right champion. With over 700 champions to choose from and 1 million plus builds, you can level up your champions to craft a strategy. Honestly guys, I thought this was just another generic game with no actual depth. However, after giving it a shot, I was surprised by the amount of content it has. Here you will encounter innovative blended PvE and PvP gameplay modes, explosive clan-centered cooperative play, and endless character skill customization. Raid is praised for its graphic quality and beautifully rendered characters. Players that enjoy fantasy combat with a more realistic approach similar to the Lord of the Rings will seriously enjoy this game. Immerse yourself in the magical world of Teleria by experiencing one of Raid's biggest features since the Doom Tower, the Cursed City. Complete its various quests and you can even get your hands on a mythical champion. Raid is celebrating 5 years by offering an exciting giveaway. Use my link in the description or scan my QR code and you get bonuses worth $100, including epic champion Lady Atezza, 500 K silver and many more right from the start. After reaching level 25, you'll get an additional 500k silver, epic skill tomes, and potions. Using my link, enter promo code FESTIVAL5 to get another epic champion Terial, 500k silver, and an endless amount of other rewards. Come find me under the name Zwag, and I'll see you on the battlefield. Thanks to Raid for sponsoring this video today. Really? I hate how Potion out heals Ignite level 1. She wants to flash Q. Did she already flash away? Why are you so fast? I'm slowing her, but she's still able to run away. I mean, she's not really getting any minions here, is she? But extra pointing Q will do more damage than an E, I think. Oh, I'm dead. Never mind. I'll take it. I got karma. All right, we definitely need boots first. Probably do attack speed shoes. Darn, he pushes in the wave. We are called Darn you, Zach. I mean, that's fine. She didn't get a kill or an assist. I'll be able to kite Zach and Garen though later. It'll be really fun. They lane swap though, Garen to counter Fizz, Karma to counter me, but I can beat her. I'll probably go mid in a little bit once I have hard steal and help Fizz out. I have a feeling though Karma will just go mid if I go mid. But if we kill her enough, she's not going to want to have anything to do with me. The reason I'm not putting points in my W is because it only works when you have an ally near that hit the same target, whereas... Ramus is probably not going to be up here much. Oh, if that Q hit. Oh no. It's a big Zack. I'm doing a lot of damage though off this first buy already. Just boots. Ooh. See, even max Q and E. Focus. 
Where was Zach? Was he bot side? He's probably... I don't know. He could be up here. Oh, I didn't get the reset on that minion. She already TP'd, right? Well, if Zach goes to Grubs to try and stop Ramus, I'm here. I think she's waiting for Zach to save her. Oh, Hallbreaker could work too on this tank build. Because I have to hit them five times. I throw in a Rage Blade. I could do um Heartsteel Rage Blade or Heartsteel Titanic Rage Blade Hallbreaker. I think it'll be really cool. I think Zach, yeah, Zach's here. I don't think that's done. Maybe. Oh. Damn it, I'm not getting the resets on these. Hmm. He's gonna jump over the wall. I might as well just leave the wave as is. It'll freeze. Oh, she did have TP. A hey, good thing I didn't push them. All right, we definitely need these attack speed shoes. It makes playing Callista a lot better. We got some HP. Playing Karma top, and you need your jungler up here. Who's three and zero and still got one v two? This is a uh, zero three though, so lane swap is working out really well for them. His husband. I mean, we have a vein. We got some late game. Kind of scared though. I definitely need. Normally, like on a tank build, hard steel build, I delay my boots for a while, but. Callista really needs boots. She's just not gonna even come near me anymore. She knows who the boss of this lane is. Oh, Zach's bot. I don't need a ward. She's literally just gonna sit there <laughs> and wave clear, so I'm gonna go roam mid and try and kill Garen. I mean, Garen will definitely fight me because he's fed. Oh, uh, maybe he's already walking up here to meet me. We go where No, he's down in a dragon. I mean, I don't care if I lose waves top. I gotta make stuff happen. Oh, we can get a shutdown here. Yep. Good job, Karma. I take it. I'm not gonna take his cannon. He's gonna miss it. He was gonna miss it. He was gonna miss it. <laughs> uh, every time I'm like, oh, I'm gonna give him the cannon, they're gonna miss it. I gotta take it. That was a good roam. Got a huge shutdown. Did we get Zach too? No. I might even be able to kill her. She's probably just gonna root me and run away. No, you thought. I baited out her flash too. I can't believe I was still in range to eat her though. It wouldn't let me at first and then it let me. Karma Top deserves to suffer. Second worst thing 
in the world takes out the first worst thing in the world. Range top versus karma top. I definitely need a Rage Blade, though, in this build, because it'll give me more E-Stacks, and because I'm so tanky, I'll be able to get so many autos off. Do I have Demolish? No. I already checked in there. What was that last game? Damn. Oh, I should probably leave. I got Heart Steel, I think. Uh-oh. Well, he already got... Oh, he needs that last one. I can't say... Oh, wait. I can pick him up. I can pick you up. Uh, I would have flashed, but I thought I could dash twice, but the stupid karma route. I got outplayed by Garen Ult. Alright, we go uh, Rage Blade next. I'll go Rage Blade, then Titanic. It's just going to be better. That's not good. I should have flashed. That's my bad. I held it. At least I didn't waste it and die, though, at the end. I hate Karma Root. What's Vayne doing? Ooh, Ezreal's big, too. I have all four of our kills, by the way. Ooh, Blitz is behind her. They're blit or they're uh Garen Nice, good roam. The Garen silence into alt is really gonna screw me over, but I'll gain some damage soon and resistance. We can throw a Terminus in last. Back to back we stood. I might as well actually put more points in E than Q now. Just because I'm going to land more auto attacks now that I'm tanky. And I don't have as much AD as a normal Callista would. I don't know where Garen is. There he is. I pop out of the bush. Shut down. Okay. Well, Blitz got the kill though. Get out of here, bro. We never rest. Get out of my lane. I gotta like straight up Ooh, that was satisfying. I gotta straight up dive her to kill her. We are called everywhere. Um one thousand for rage blade. I just, I kind of need to go roam because if I sit top all game, they might lose too hard. See, the thing is, Fizz is going to lose to her too. But if she gets a kill, she'll be worth more money. Getting armor boots? Zach's gonna jump back in. Your 
Bro, Fizz, go top, man. Can you go top? Fizz, please go top. I just lose top turret and die because of him. If only he hit Garen there. He just kind of stood there and died. Man. I'm getting such bad teammates. I have every kill on the team besides the one that died to turret bot. But I'm going to get outplayed by the 1000 true damage Garen ult. Well, Garen's dead. Nice. Wait. Oh, no. He got him. Alright, let's see if I can do anything bot. The problem is I don't have enough damage yet to actually kill Zack and Garen because they're so damn fed. Once I get Rageblade Titanic, I might, but I might need something else. Take it. The Lulu took a lot to kill. Alright, extra stacks on E now. Ah, why is the bush warded, man? Okay, it's okay. There's always a chance to come back. Who do I get? Does Rageblade work with a Hallbreaker? What the heck? There's two plants right here. Uh, this is not that good. Because I can't really dodge Zack while I'm silenced by Garen. Okay, I got damage now. We just gotta get those shutdowns on Garen and Zack. There's his ult. Ult and flash. Zack's gotta be over here. Oh, nice. He hit the plant. He's gonna turn and, like, kill Ramus, though. Ah, I didn't go over the wall. Zack. Okay, we're coming back. Where was Zack that whole time? Oh, he's bot. We're getting some objective bounties. I think I go Titanic, get an auto reset. Oh my god! <laughs> that ain't gonna save her, Lulu. <laughs> what happened to the Zack? Oh, 
we really need we really need this dragon I need the base Beautiful. Beautiful. <laughs> We're doing it. We're coming back. The Zach's not fighting with them anymore. What happened? He could still steal this pretty easy. I'm going to ignite him just so he doesn't heal. Played by dodging everything. Why is Vayne still top? Damn it, we lose another dragon. Bro, did he build a G? He built a GA! I was like, why? Why does he have a GA? <laughs> he has a GA! He's got two revives. Alright, I really needed a buy, but there's just like so much fighting. I mean, at least this soul isn't like auto win for them, but it's a pretty strong soul. Where do I go next? I think I go Terminus next. I could use some armor and MR. More damage. And then I might go. I mean, I want to go Hallbreaker so bad, but the game turned into a 1v5. I don't know how good it'd be. I might just need a Blade of the Ruin King. We trusted. Or I could go Terminus Jack Shows. Oh, I might need a Runins. If anything, we need the 0 and 8 Fizz to split, and we need Vayne in the team fight. But Vayne, I don't think, is ever going to group. Are they on Baron? No, they're all bot. Uh, somebody's still around mid, I think. Yeah, if they're just gonna be 5v5s, I have to go Runins. Ooh, we've got Engage on their bottom. There's no way they're doing Baron, right? They don't have enough. Well, they could. They could be on Baron. I think they might get it. It's gonna take them a while. But we're just too far. Yep. I had a feeling they were doing that. Nowhere to go. Why the fuck did Ramus go into their turret? 
<laughs> what is he doing? I pick him up to peel me. And he dives turret instead of peeling me. Bane, are you gonna ult? Okay, now she's auto attacking. Okay. Not bad. I really need a Runins because I'm just like fighting five people at once, unfortunately. I really wanted this game not to be a 1v5 so I could split push his tank Callista. But it turned into a 1v5. This act does so much damage to me. I'm taking, like, it's like all magic damage. Really good at running away. We're gonna lose top turret. I think Vayne's like tilted and she's just, just gonna side lane permanently. They're gonna go for mid tower next. Zach's still standing behind this wall. Okay, maybe not anymore. Oh, soul. We need to get to this. Probably gone. But Zach, wasn't Zach top? Yeah. We got to fight. If you kill Zach, that's pretty big. Oh my god, I smited it. Dude, what are- he's gotta kill him ten damn times, bro. Come here. What happened to my Ramus? I picked him up. There he is. Oh, no. Does he end? He doesn't end, but we're gonna lose our base. Damn it, man. Ah, that sucks. Now he's just gonna perma split. I just go wits over. Nothing I think I'll just go wits so over terminus. Stop. I don't know. The one time Vayne doesn't side lane. Okay. I'm really strong, but yeah, they're probably gonna win the game off a of back door now. Bro, the Zach's triple revive just stalls so much time for them. Wits is better here than Terminus because I it gives more damage. It gives me tenacity and more magic resist, which is everything I need. Our task is Garen is gonna just run for the base. I'm just gonna take the AD potion. Yep, look at him. Okay, Vane, you could have stunned him into the wall, but you just stand there. Good job. I got wave clear. I definitely needed a runes. Oh, he did. Her base. 
is going to be a long game just because of the stupid open base. Oh yeah, Baron. Baron's where we... Objectives are where we lose the game though because they just send somebody in our base. We could get some vision on that Baron, that'd be nice. I need the tenacity because I'm getting polymorphed every fight, I'm getting rooted, like silenced. We got a little bit of time to fight him. Somebody's bot. Man, please, please. Being split bot. Uh, that didn't hit me. What the hell? I can't. I have to defend. Yeah, they could do this. I can defend. Like, go to Baron. They can duo Baron. Their team might go check it though. Oh, he's wrong. This is this is so annoying. I got three people in three different lanes running for the Nexus. We got uh Baron though, we're gonna get TPs back in. We gotta get to this. Zach's gonna be on that. Not on it. I think he still could be waiting somewhere bot to back door. He doesn't really kill the base fast, so. Doing it. I shouldn't have took that crab from Ramus. I just wanted it dead so I could see. Why did I swap? What do you mean? The swap is the only thing that keeps you in the game. He would have got ran over if he was top. They're tilted though. That's good. The problem is, I mean, I got Baron recalled, but if I get jumped on by their whole team, they're going to send somebody for Fizz, though. If I get jumped on by their whole team, I'm pretty sure I'm dead, but, okay, that's probably Garen ult. Yeah, we could push mid. How long do I have on Baron recall? A lot of time. We trust it. Base. They stopped my base. They went. Blitz is there. We're fine. I really don't even need to base, but I just want to in case. Because they don't have enough damage to kill Garen, but with me here, he's dead. Okay. No boots for Phantom Dancer. Terrible advice. Callista's jump scales with her boots. If I don't have boots, I'm not going to jump anywhere. Phantom Dancer, I think, is also slower than boots. Alright, let's get this one now. Dude, I haven't been hit in forever now because they're just trying to... They're just trying to win the game off splitting. Just go top now.
I'm attacking fast. We did it! Oh my god. <laughs> I thought we were gonna lose when we lost our base. The team actually came together, like... Everybody started doing work. I mean, I don't know what Vayne was doing, but Ramus and Blitz were, like, everywhere they needed to be. And Fizz, even though he was, like, running it down, he still put pressure on the map. Him dying top allowed me to get bot in him. Let's go. Give it to... Ramus, I guess. I don't know. Everybody did well besides Vayne, but at least she played. All right, yeah, look at the damage chart. We did almost 60k damage. I really wanted to try this with a hull breaker, though, because I auto so many times. The game just did not go the pace that I wanted it to. Look at that lethal tempo uptime, almost 240. That was pretty tanky at the end. They couldn't kill me. They were pretty mad. Yeah, GG. Thanks for watching. Make sure you leave a like, you subscribe to the channel, you subscribe. I'll see you later. Peace.